Hey there everybody, Martin Laner here, Tangerine Technology, and we are outside, so you guys can see, this is the outside of my office, uh, there we go, see, nice little view that we got, it is snowing, it is March, it is the end of March, uh, I'm not sure when this video will go up, but it is the end of March and it is snowing, so yeah, it's not that cold, uh, it's about minus 8 I think Celsius, it's got to be 20 degrees Fahrenheit, something like that, so not too bad. Um, this will be a really quick video, but I'm going to show you guys what uh, what the real world looks like of uh, servers that are deployed in environments where IT providers, IT people don't care really about them. They set them up and that's all they care about. So we're going to take a look quickly at the server. Take a look. You can see, I don't know how well you guys can see how good the light is, but you can see here there's, uh, there's a lot of dust in this thing. Again, I don't know if you can see it, but uh, if you look in here in the CPU fan, yeah, I'm sorry, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's just caked. It's just caked in there. So we're gonna blow that out. We're just gonna do a video of blowing it out because it should be a cool video. So I'm gonna set this like this. Here we we have an air blower. Just got an electric air blower that I'm gonna use. So. Hope that looks all right. I, <laughs> I have no idea what that's gonna look like, so we'll see what the video looks like. But anyways, um, there's a lot of dust that popped out of that. Um, but yeah, something as simple as that, I mean, it takes, you guys just saw, it takes 30 seconds to do it. And um, if you do do it, then, you know, fans don't get caked, fans don't fail because they can't spin, things don't overheat because the heat sinks are clogged, et cetera, et cetera. It's very simple to do. Uh, really, it's what everybody should be doing with their systems. It should, you know, if you're a third-party provider, you should be doing this regularly for your clients. Like I said, nobody does. Um, I haven't seen anybody that actually goes and does physical maintenance on systems. And yeah, that's just something that uh, that often gets overlooked. But obviously, as you just saw, it is important because things do clog up, and that's why th generally that's why things fail prematurely. Um, a lot of the time, it's because of things like fans are clogged up, heat sinks are clogged up, things overheat because they can't cool enough. So yeah, again, short video, but I will see you guys at the next one.